life won't be any different if you keep on doing the same thing that doesn't work out over and over again. Hello guys, welcome back. Today I want to talk about how to achieve a better and successful life. If you are not satisfied with where you are right now, no matter if it's financially, career-wise, or socially, maybe it's time to change and adopt some new methods because life won't be any different if you keep on doing the same thing that doesn't work out over and over again, right? So in today's video, I wanna share three simple ways that you can use to start to change your life. And all you need to do is just keep on watching so my tip number one is don't stop learning I know you've heard this thousands of times but my question is if you agree have you taken any actions I know we are all busy in life but if you are not willing to spend at least a little portion of your time in a day to learn something new and grow are you really ready for a better life and remember new opportunities are usually found outside of your comfort zone so it's your call when I say don't stop learning, I mean to learn something new that will benefit and make you more capable or competitive in your career or in your life. It could be as simple as staying curious about the latest trend or listening to your favorite podcast while driving or watching a YouTube video about how to create a cash flow during your lunch break. If you like to read, maybe spend 30 minutes before your bedtime to read a new book. Imagine how much time in a day that we just spend on meaningless stuff. Even if it's only 10 to 15 minutes every day, you will accumulate over time and start making an impact in your life because everything's baby steps, right? And my tip number two is be selective about your social circle. I know many of you have heard that you are the average of the five people that you spend the most time with. The way I interpret it is not to pick your top five friends to hang out with, but uh, to be more aware of who's around you and impacting your life. When I say be selective, I'm not saying you should only hang out with rich or successful people. No, I mean you want to spend more time with people who have positive energy who inspire and guide you. We all know the saying that your vibe attracts your tribe, which is so true because you are also a great influence for people around you. Like my friends and I, we are each other's mentor. Sometimes they need me for mental support, for life advice, and that's how we grow together and become stronger. So if you always get negativity from a friend who's always complaining or gives you bad influence, maybe it's time to reconsider the relationship. Remember Remember, your vibe attracts your tribe. So my tip number three is self-care. You are your best asset. Without a healthy body and mind, it's hard for us to achieve our goals in life. Self-care could be as simple as a regular workout, meditation, um, eating healthy, or enjoying some quality me time, getting your facials or your nails done, or enjoying a vacation. Like for me, when I feel so stressed, I like to take a hot shower and not think about anything. I also enjoy traveling or spending quality time cooking or watching a movie with my loved ones. I know many times we forget to self-care because of our busy schedule in life. But hey, at the end of the day, it's just you and yourself and you don't want to regret not taking care of yourself and spend more money and time to make up for it down the road and you'll also be surprised how much more you can do when you feel rested and when you feel recharged for example I am way more productive and creative at work when I get a good rest and when I'm in a good mood so it's definitely worth the time and energy you invest in so those are my three tips of how you can invest yourself for a better, happier, and successful life. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I'll see you very soon in my next one. Bye guys.